Good morning, YouTube. At least it's morning for me. I don't know if it is for you. My name's Kevin Hoops. Gonna be shooting some arrows today with my bow, so if you guys wanna watch it, come on along for the ride. If not, I'll see you later. Maybe, maybe not, not too sure, but gonna be shooting some arrows at 30 yards. So here we've got my bow, Hoyt Torex. Um, nothing too special. I think that's where it says Torex. Actually, it's Torex XT. Uh, not sure if that makes a difference at all. Smaller compared to this one. But um, other than that, we're going to be shooting at 30 yards right here. Down range to there. And uh, without further ado, let's get this shit going. Right into the tent. Might be on the border, but I'm pretty sure I snuck it in there. Same spot, I think a little bit more to the left. I will say, I think I'm liking the eastern arrows better, but this is what will really tell. bit to the right there. I think that was me though. Slipped on the form a little bit. Ooh. A little higher but I think it's still in a 10. Let's go check her out. Left, right. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Man, that one just snuck out there on the red. I don't like that one. I don't like you at all. Got two in the 10 though. You can see a little marker, you know, thanks to my dad. Great at problem solving, you know, once you start to wear down your target, all you gotta do is get a little Sharpie and just trace around it all right that simple not too bad at 40 though i'm gonna see if i can get all four of them in the yellow which i think i can easily do but you know just warm up a little warm up first two are in there though it's the eastern one gotten in the red hopefully i don't know which angle's better you know we'll get there you know i'm gonna try something real quick all right got the other camera set up down there so hopefully actually when i shoot you guys will see the shot Little to the right. All the birds are starting to come alive. Those are both of the Easterns too. Ooh. Then that was right by the second one. That's a good group in right there. Good group in right there. Sun's starting to come out. I'm gonna start to get sweaty. And my glasses start to fog up. That's what happens when you have glasses and shitty eyes. Shit sucks. Last and final day, bro. Woo! 
That one might have been by the second one. Might have a little two group and match up right there. Might have a little two group and match up right there. For the second time, second shot. That's all four in there, baby. <laughs> I would say not too bad. What up, bitch? Two camera angles. How about that? All right. Four arrows. See how I go one more time at 40 or 30. See how the third one goes. And I think I'm going to put the other target up on there. Get the good old deer. And then I think I want to shoot from sitting down because I haven't done that at all. All right. So you guys probably can't see it from here. But I did change the block down there. I didn't change the block. I added the block down there. So we're going to be shooting on a smaller target. So let's see how it goes. So let's see what we can do. That one was in there. My crosses are already fogging up. I'm not even that sweaty. Jeez. Let's see what happens if I take the hat off. I think we're on the border. It's a pretty thick border on the circle, the dark part. It's just a little high. kind of look like they're high so let's see where they actually are so i was kind of right that was the first one way high that was a big flinch i think or just the recoil of the bow i wasn't controlling enough but this thick border i was getting i snuck one on the border i want to get one in there gotta get at least one oh. only took me an extra five minutes because i couldn't find the screws but the target set up very hard for me to tell where the arrows go on this target because I'm colorblind and brown doesn't treat me very well on a red brown red green colorblind in case any of you cared which you probably don't but That might have been a little bit more in the lungs, more in the liver. I like that one. Right where I want it to be, good follow through. Two heart shots right there, one right on the outside, and one, like I said, it was like more towards the lungs, it's probably more of a liver shot. 
not too shabby now if you also look number one that is not the regular kill zone of a deer that's that size and that's not the regular size of an eight point buck nor is an eight point buck going to be bigger than the tree it's right next to i don't care what the angle of the picture is supposed to be drawn from or whatever i understand but hey i'm just looking for the kill zone and we're in the kills and that's all i really care about now what i need is a little chair because i want to shoot sitting down like this so uh let's go grab one of them <clears throat> oh all right so i've never really shot from sitting down before so if it's shitty shots that's why <laughs> already given excuses let's see how it goes Probably shot a little early there, a little earlier than I had to. I think maybe pulling the bow back at first was a little different, but other than that, you know, as long as you have it to your left, it should be a pretty simple shot. Ooh, that one was way to the left. I don't know if it's sitting down or because I was shooting a good amount yesterday. But my left shoulder it does feel very strained all of a sudden. I think it's because I shot a lot like last night and it is the morning right now. So there wasn't that much in between time of shooting. My shoulder is feeling it now. Might have been a little high. I am coming from a different angle technically. I'm more level, I'm not as high up. It's not that much of an angle difference, but. Let's go see how we did. All right, so I was completely wrong on the groupings here, but it was four for four in the kill zone, which I am not too unhappy about. That one's on the edge, but not bad. And then two on the heart, right on the edge though. Not too shabby. So that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this, that, the other thing. Just shooting some arrows at 30 yards, nothing too big. Did switch up the targets obviously I, I did enjoy sitting down honestly it's something different i haven't tried it before but i do have the season coming up september 17th for whitetail archery so you guys will be seeing plenty of that when the season does start so hopefully you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you on the next video